Now we'll see what is meant by rigid body. Thin ma porul. Rigid body na inna na. Or object mela or force apply pani na. The force apply pan dalan the object unde display sagam from one position to another position. But or periye sever erka. Or periye kallo or paray erka. The paray mela mayu ni force apply pan na. And the object move agma. Ni force apply pan ra. But because of the force applied, there is a very big object. In the object or position, I move pan a mudiya because of the force applied. And the mari object ke because of the force applied, there is no change in its position or and the shape lo kora change varak kudal. And the mari irak object sa shape or volume that should not be there should not be any change in the shape or the volume of the object. That type of objects we call it as a rigid objects. Rigid. Body is unsula. Ana in practice mati na there will be no rigid body or perfect rigid body pa ka mudi yada because of the force apply slight na ak molecule ada change ay ruko kandi pa or rigid body inta di ruka yada. So how I can you define this rigid body because of the force apply there will should not be any change in its position or shape or volume of the object. Anu mari ruka object yada na ma rigid body is unsulu. Now we'll see how what will be the. And the matter of rigid bodies, the rotational motion. How do you do? Now you all meet the translatory motion. Look, rotational motion. Compare it. Look. So in the translatory motion, la inertia is one property. Pat look. By Newton's second law, already we have seen this. Rotational motion. La inertia under the inertia is nothing but the fundamental property of a object because of which it can't able to change its position by itself. और पुरुल वंदे तन्ना आलिए तनोडे नेला ये मार्च कोला मुड़िया आदा ना नम्बर इनर्शिया प्रॉपर्टीज़ सुनो इन ट्रांसलेटरी मोशन ला इनर्शिया वंदे इट डिपेंड्स अपन द मास ऑफ़ द ऑब्जेक्ट मास कमी आ रहा इनर्शिया कमी मास अधिक मार गदी मार गे इनर्शिया अधिक मार गो इधर यदल लाय ट्रांसलेटरी मो Inertia, or we will call this as a coefficient of inertia also. But in rotational motion, the object is going to rotate about an axis. Or axis, when I all objects are rotate, I have clear. So if I take any object and it is going to rotate about an axis, this. Illa in the rotation, if you rotate agla, or it may also rotate like this. You take any object, this will be the axis of rotation. In the axis, when the object rotate, I have x o x dash. So there will be n number of particles. All particles. So in the axis of which it is, they are going to rotate. So all the particles will be rotating in a circular path. So all objects go a circular path. They will come both. In the position between the axis of rotation, the axis of rotation, all the particles go. In a go, there will be no displacement at all. The axis la vandu a particles vandu rotate panna adu. Then the particular point adha, and the straight line path adha. Namina sulro straight line na na center of axis no. And the axis is known. This we call it as the axis. And the axis is based on the LM particles rotate. And the more you rotate, it will go. For example, you take this point P. N number of particles are known. All of them 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 are known. The particles are known. Mass is different. Same. 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 There are N number of particles. All of the particles are known. All of them are known. Certain angular velocity they are going to rotate like this. In the axis are based on it, the object is going to rotate like this. So, one object is called linear velocity. When an object makes a rotational motion, its linear velocity goes on changes. Why? Because of the change in direction. Direction change is not the linear velocity. Change is not the same, but its angular velocity omega remains to be the same. So coming to this rotational motion, in rotational motion la, inga mass amatto edukka matto. Since they are going to rotate about an axis, and its distance will be different for different masses. Yella particles or a distance la rukuma inga or object rukum inga or particle rukum inga rukla inga rukla inga vana rukla ya. So the distance also plays a very important role in this rotational motion from the axis of rotation. Or axis or maya pagdi avichitda na yella the whole object to suti rukka. अब पे इंगे वंदर रोटेशनल मोशन में मास ओढ़ा है, हमारे डिस्टेंस यूँ इन्हें ऐड तो करों। That we call it as the moment of inertia. How this coefficient of inertia in translatory motion? Here in rotational motion we call this as the moment of inertia. Moment of inertia के दा I symbol. So it is given by I is equal to m r square that is the product of mass into the square of the distance between the object and the axis of rotation. So इध compare पनी पढ़िंगे translatory motion ले ये पड़ी coefficient of inertia वो it is determined by the mass. Here in rotational motion this is determined by the moment of inertia. ये पड़ी moment of inertia वो rotational motion. 
moment of inertia so it has rotational motion la da coefficient of inertia so it that is in transitory motion so it is determined by the mass and the square of the distance between the object and the axis of rotation so in the, in the difference is very important rendu compare panni padinga so rotational motion of rigid bodies la எப்படி ஒரு ஆப்ஜெக்ட் வந்து ஒரு ரிஜிட் பாடி ரொட்டேட் பண்ணும்போது அதன் லீனியர் வெலாசிட்டி சேஞ்ச் ஆகிட்டே இருக்கும் பட் ஆங்குலர் வெலாசிட்டி இட் மீன்ஸ் டு ப